Army Recognition editorial team is in Nuremberg, Germany to cover the IWA 2017 Outdoor Classic. This event is dedicated for the hunting and outdoor activities, but also many international companies for the global manufacturer and producer of small arms present latest innovation and technology of small arms and weapons, especially dedicated for civilian markets. MKK is a government company and main supplier of Turkish army. We produce defense industry products. We have 10 factories. We produce small arms, small ammunition, heavy arms, heavy uh, weapons. And also we produce for civil uh, products, for hunting. In fact, uh, this is uh, new designed and produced by MK engineers, assault rifle. MPT-76, a civil version, for hunting version, we brought here. It is not uh, allowed to bring assault rifle. This is designed uh, by MKA engineers. Uh, it has a rectangular uh, backstop. It can arrange uh, according to the uh, person. And also, it has picatinny rise. You can put some accessories, three size. Also, it has a uh, hammer uh, produced barrel, special barrel, and also it has a composite uh, magazine. You can see inside the how many rounds. Also, it has the silence uh, position system silence, and also this uh, hand grip uh, system. Now we have been producing for Turkish army. Uh, 20,000 uh, pieces. This is menu manual uh, site, but uh, optic optic site also adaptable here. To, in Turkey also there is a company uh, it can uh, produce optical site. Turkey uh, army has a program to replace all G3 rifles with this new design and product MPT 76 rifles. But as far as I know. Before NATO was also a program, generally five, five, six uh, caliber weapon system. And now uh, some of NATO member countries also changed their policy to 7.62 caliber is most effective. It is a 20 capacity this uh, composite magazine. Also uh, rate of fire. 600 uh, minus and plus 50. Also, the effective range of 600 meters. Our system, I could say that we are uh, bringing to the market a smart sighting solution in a different uh, wave band, like in IR, in daylight. We provide to the user a full-featured sighting system. We've, uh, if we take an example of this one, it will be a laser rangefinder, the orientation sensors, which considering elevation and hand angle of the rifle, the surround condition sensors, and all this data goes to the ballistic computer, which is inside the scope the site and uh, it gives the full ballistic calculation with automatic uh, reticle shifting to the proper position. If we look on the other companies who are doing uh, sighting solution, uh, no one provides such ideology. They just, if we take like a thermal site, others just have thermal site like, like a daylight one but in a thermal wave band.
and uh, it's full our technology, our design. The laser rangefinder are developed and manufactured by us. The only thing we are buying uh, from the technology point of view, that's an infrared sensor from other manufacturers. We are focused on whole the world because the ded dedicated customers, that's uh, special forces teams, and uh, we are promoting our system in uh, Middle East countries, in North America, South America and Europe, of course. This one is a wind weather station. This system sends the data about wind force and direction. It has sensors like temperature, humidity, pressure, wind force, wind direction. All this data transmit to the system and uh, used in a ballistic calculation. We introduced the P10 here because the EVA in general is one of the widest exhibitions and biggest exhibitions during the year and we each year we present some news from the from the from the CZ so that's the reason why we came here to introduce the P10 as well. The C letter means compact size and the reason behind the P10 is that we we would like to go on the market with the striker fired guns. We always saw the huge potential in that. So it's actually the striker fired striker fired gun from CZ which is uh, usually known for the single action double action guns but uh, we, we wanted to go for the market for the military and law enforcement officers or the concealed carry and hobby shooters as well for uh, the striker fired gun. It's probably one of the best grips on the market right now. Uh, the ergonomics was always the benefit of the CZ ever since the Mr. Kotsky designed the CZ-75 uh, more than 40 years ago. So we will try to keep that and we redesigned it with our defense system which means we digitally scan the people, people's hands and palms to define the ideal grip. Also, the trigger is quite good, so you get pretty good feeling on the trigger. You have about one kg until this point over there, right before the fire, and then you have a, about one millimeter trigger travel to fire the gun. Also, the reset is quite short, so the trigger will be definitely one of the benefits for, for the uh, CZP-10. We have introduced this machine gun that is not really a machine gun, it's a semi-automatic rifle. It looks like a machine gun, it's based on the, the aesthetical, it's based on the FN Mini Me. And uh, it was built just exclusively for a commercial market. So it's shooting with closed bolt, it's fit by magazine only and has an armor and trigger system like an IR-15. We removed from our uh, military version the system for links. We modified the bolt, so it's shooting with closed bolt only. All the trigger housing and trigger system is modified to shoot semi-auto only. And there is a buffer system like an IR-15 for recoil. The, also the, gas, the barrel and gas system are modified to do not accept military parts. The military version is built as a machine gun. This one is built as a semi-automatic rifle with machine guns look only.